One of the Spokane Police Department's command staff is on paid administrative leave tonight in a dust-up over moving a police precinct to a new location. The city suspended Captain Brad Arleth on Monday for an alleged policy violation that angered the top brass at Spokane City Hall. Arleth was in charge of relocating the downtown police precinct near the SDA bus plaza to its new home at the Intermodal Center at Sprague and Bernard. And that's where KXY 4's Jeff Humphrey working for you tonight. And Jeff, uh, the police chief not saying why one of his trusted captains is in trouble. He is not saying, Nadine, because this matter was just handed over to the department's internal affairs unit, although KXY4 sources are saying that Captain Arleth is being investigated for allegedly being insubordinate to someone at Spokane City Hall. We know that Arleth was not happy about moving the precinct from its high visibility location on Riverside to the much less traveled Intermodal Center, also known as Spokane's bus and train station. Our sources say the last straw broke when the pre Precinct received delivery of its new furniture, and Arleth was displeased with its poor quality. And then something happened after that that got him in trouble with the folks at City Hall. Chief Rick Jabro defends the precinct's move to the city-owned Intermodal Center because it'll save taxpayers money on rent. The chief also says the new location will shift police resources to the east side of downtown, where we're seeing a lot of new businesses and renovations as the university district expands. The foot patrols, the bicycle patrols, the making contacts with business uh, owners in the area, none of that is going to change. They're just going to be reporting to work at a different location. The department ha hopes to have the new precinct here at the Intermodal Center up and running by Thursday. Chief Dubronadine says the internal affairs investigation involving Arleth will be wrapped up quickly. Arleth is expected to keep his job because of the great work he's done driving down crime here in downtown Spokane. We're talking about double-digit decreases, but Nadine Arleth is also going to have to recognize the powers that be at City Hall. Reporting live downtown, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.